much you know about the traditional practices in a Chinese wedding. In today's society, young people prefer to do away with the traditions and adopt Western wedding. Today, we will bring you on a journey to the Heritage Wedding Gallery to discover more. The Heritage Wedding Gallery was established in 2010 to create awareness among people about this rich heritage. The dowry is a blessing gift from the bride's parents. It has baby prosperity set, contains bathtub, potty with charcoals inside, bed sheet, colour tree set and bed set lamps. The potty charcoal is believed to bless the groom with lots of properties. Toilet tree set symbolises the beginning of the couple blissful marriage. The clocks are replaced by bedroom sleepers for the couple to have good career. Sewing machine is replaced by sewing kit to help the bride fulfill her duties. Tea set is used when the couple serves tea to their parents to show gratitude for their upbringing. Hi, Auntie Pat. May we ask, what are the common items here that most parents will buy for their daughter as dowry? Most of them will get the essential items like baby bathtub, potty, battery-separated lamps, red handkerchief, fan, red umbrella, a plastic plate which comes with things such as packets of red and green beans, believed to ward off evil spirits. Nongans and red date symbolizes everlasting marriage. A day before the wedding, the respective parents of the bride and groom will perform the ritual of combing the couple's hair three times at an auspicious time. Auntie Pat, how about the groom's family? What dowry do they prepare for the bride? Aha! Uh -huh. About the groom's side, the groom's parents will buy four items of gold for the bride as betrothal jewellery. The groom also gives a red packet to the bride's parents. Besides that, even numbered cares of pot trotters will be given to the bride's parents. Pot trotters replace the raw pot leg used in the olden days. This practice is to thank the bride's parents for bringing up the bride since birth. After knowing so much, I'll bring you through some taboos that you should avoid in a Chinese wedding. To ensure fertility, no one should touch the bridal bed. If the bride wants a son, she can ask a young boy to roll around on the bed. A rooster and hen will be placed under the bed. The first animal that runs out would determine the gender of the firstborn baby. It is believed that the bride will be obedient to the groom if he kicks the door or wheel of the vehicle before he fetches the bride. Also, knives and sharp objects are bad choices as wedding gifts. This symbolizes broken marriage. For good livelihood of the groom, a pair of bowls with spoons and chopsticks is given to the couple. We hope you've enjoyed and learned as much for today's journey. Who knows, somewhere in future, you might want to hold a traditional Chinese wedding.